And, and it's really lovely to see the comments that are coming in. Emma says, I didn't even think this was possible. Well done, ladies. Um, what a fantastic bond. Sharing breastfeeding sounds like a dream. Such a lovely story. I wish my husband um, could, could help. Um, but then we've got the comments like Kirsty saying, I couldn't let another woman breastfeed my baby regardless if she was my partner or not. And then you get the inevitable, sorry, it's just not natural. What would you say to those people who are not so easily uh, won over by this? Um, we're not trying to change people's opinions. It's, it's not really up for debate. We more just want to educate and help women out there who are in a similar position and who even women who are in heterosexual relationships who might have low supply and they might not know that these options are open to them to help them to breastfeed mm. their babies. Um, we're never going to change everyone's minds and we're never going to reach everyone but the people who we can help will be the ones that will listen and I think to comment about um, not being able to share the feeding even if you're a partner if she was your partner well she's not in our position so she can't say that for sure but that's okay that's her opinion and, and we know that we'll help the people who need us. Well it obviously suits the two of you and, and your daughter congratulations by the way. Well done congratulations. And your, your lovely thank daughter. You. And thank, thank you for taking time thank to talk to us today absolutely fascinating fascinating yeah, amazing. I had no idea. I think it's incredible isn't it and yeah. I think the only thing to you know the thing it is important to mention is that it's important thing, infections can be passed on from mother to baby mm. through breastfeeding um, but i'm sure in this case you know they've been screened and yeah. they've, they've thought about that yeah lovely okay. thank, thank you, you so much indeed, doctor.